Hey guys, make sure to stand till the end. If you make one common mistake, it can cost you thousands of dollars in future repairs. Stay with us, we'll explain what it is. Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you guys having a GMC Sierra that generation right here from year 2007 to year 2013. If you need to find where the trailer left turn signal fuse is located, which fuse you need to check, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays, anything for a really good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time. Why it's important to always test fuses and relays. All that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience make sure to stay until the end. So before we start guys, let us tell you a little bit about us. Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. We take them completely apart. We show you how to do engines, transmission, mechanical, bodywork, a little bit of everything guys. We have more than 13,000 free repair videos on our channels that can save you thousands of dollars guys in future repairs. We have anything from American to German vehicles, Asian, uh, anything guys. So now uh, if you need to find, let's say you're in the middle of nowhere, you need to find a video for a starter fuse or uh, you need to see where the starter relay is located all we have to do is just come find that on our channel it will take you about a minute or two to watch it you fix it you're back on the road guys so that's why we're making all these videos for your convenience so let's go ahead and start on it now so the trailer left turn signal fuse where you can expect to find it we will demonstrate guys this on that generation gmc sierra that we have here you guys have multiple fuse boxes in that gmc but we'll be working just one fuse box that's under the hood so open the hood now here on the driver's side next to your brake pump we'll check this box here open that cover underneath you'll find the main engine fuse box with a layout like this one or it will look really close to that one before we continue let's explain why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays it is guys very important to test fuses and relays on those fuses you cannot clearly see if they're burnt or not especially you can see in the jk's fuses as well and if you guys assume okay let's say you remove a fuse you look at it and you assume guys that it's a, actually a, a good fuse but it's actually a bad fuse sometimes you cannot clearly see that what can easily happen guys at that point uh, you can uh, uh, put the bad fuse in and you start replacing parts and tools that you don't need to so you lose your time you lose your money to fix a problem that doesn't exist when all we had to do is test the fuse and replace it we'll put a link to a special video that will teach you how to test fuses how to check relays very easily as well guys so uh, check it out it will be in the description of the video below here guys we'll need to check one fuse oh by the way if you need to buy any fuses relays parts to use a good price quick shipping for gmc sierra or any car we'll put the links in the description of the video below for your convenience check it out that way you do not waste your money and time we will come in that section that's towards the windshield if we zoom in a little bit here guys the fuse that we're looking for the trailer left turn signal we're talking about fuse number three which is that 10m fuse right here you will need to check if you guys have any questions don't hesitate to let us know thank you for watching see you next time